guys so this morning I noticed that I was getting an error on my Outlook um, and I have Outlook 2010 um, and the error that I was getting uh, pretty much looked something like this here um, it's a RSS um, feed error that I was getting and it's very um, annoying it just kept popping up popping up each time that I would go and you know um, click on this little option here send and receive with all folders um, now I did some research and found out that the problem that I was having uh, seems like a lot of people uh, were having the same problem and it's actually due to a uh, RSS feed that's directly from um, I think it's actually from USA.gov or .gov um, that kept popping up with that uh, that error so all I did pretty much I went into my RSS feeds here and I deleted that one now this is not the actual uh, folder because I already fixed the problem on my end and it will my system won't let me recreate it but uh, once you delete those USA.gov uh, RSS feed the problem should be resolved and pretty much if you guys take a look at the screen um, here it shows you the specific error that I uh, that I was actually getting I actually copied and pasted in here uh, but yeah I kept on getting that um, that error so I went ahead and just you know went I search and I found the dot gov and I just went ahead and delete the folder directly it's gonna ask you to confirm it once you delete it just make sure that you hit uh, send and receive again just to you know make sure that the problem is correct um, and also keep in mind that you may have more than one of those dot gov uh, RSS feed as well so you, you might want to erase both of them or if you have more than two I in, you know in my case I only had two but if you have more than two you want to go ahead and just erase all of the uh, USA.gov um, RSS feed because you'll get errors similar to you know these um, that I have up here alright so once you guys erase it then you guys should be all set and also I'm gonna have uh, all my notes in the description so if you guys want you know more information feel free to look in the description and follow the steps as well if you're still not able to figure it out and it's giving you a hard time please visit our website at logicpcsolutions.com again it's www.logicpcsolutions.com where we can assist you uh, via remote support fixing this error as well as a wide range of other issues uh, we do computer tune-up virus removals as well as other uh, services that uh, we can assist you as long as you have the internet so visit our website again logicpcsolutions.com and thanks for watching also don't forget to subscribe thank you bye bye